approximately 6 10 p.m uh your name sir robert gold okay and you called for assistance with a vehicle that was parked in front of your home right right in front and right where the walk is okay and were you satisfied with our response very okay and we were able to get the vehicle out of here without an incident absolutely okay sir thank you is there anything else we can do for you today no i really appreciate it thank you sir have okay. a great day all right just so you know that that's you awesome. see that? Yeah. So we, the fact that we care about their responses, and they're not all perfect. We have some bad ones. They're like, no, nope, you're late, and uh, I want an apology, and <laughs> we will apologize. And, you know, you want to hear from the supervisor, and I, I'll go meet with them and mm -hmm. make it right. Mm -hmm. You know, explain how this happened and why it won't happen again. And it's very rare. I can't remember the last time it happened, but it has happened where I've had to go and meet with them and explain that that's not acceptable and we will not be accepting uh, a lack of service on our side. Yes. Yeah, that's great. Transparency. That's really it is cool. transparency. And I, hey, we complain, it's going to be documented and everybody sees it, goes in your file, that's all there is. There's no, get played off and I make excuses. We screwed up, we screwed up. Guy put the GPS in wrong and went to the wrong address. Okay, he put the GPS in, he put it in the GPS wrong and went to the wrong address. There's no way to play that off. We can't say the GPS satellites were messed up and then, you know, this is what happened. We just simply own it and just say, you know, we're gonna make sure our guys study the streets more so these mistakes don't happen. Hello? Hello? They're not from the neighborhood. 